So find the present value using the present value formula to achieve $3,500 in six years at 7.2% interest compounded monthly. So it seems like this is a compounded periodically. So monthly is n equal to 12. So what are the information is given here? Let's actually sort it out here a little bit. So our n is equal to 12. That's monthly. That is the rate r is equal to 7.2 percent or basically you convert a decimal and this is time which is a t is equal to 6 sometimes it's going to be numeral or sometimes it's going to be word so we have to be very careful figuring that out and this one down here is very important we cannot mess around with this one this is not a principle this is something we're going to have in our account later on so this is going to be our total amount in future after six years so that is amount so what we are looking for we are looking for fee the principle that is or not given so if we know the present value formula so if we know the present value formula we can actually work it out present value formula or we can actually work out from the compounded formula so this compounded formula we plug everything in only thing P is not given but one step ahead if you know how to isolate fee by itself or this would be also beautiful we just plug this in here is going to give the answer straight forward so well i'm going to look into the right one here first so fee is equal to i'm going to actually look into this right side here fee is equal to amount so what is the amount amount is this down here which is 3500 3500 dollar is the total amount after six years is going to be so that's amount now on the bottom we have one plus r what is the r rate is 7.2 percent 7.2 percent you can convert to decimal also n is 12 to the power 12 times the t which is a 6 so again this is under one division sign so we can just plug this in through the calculator if we look into this calculator here so it's going to be beautiful so we just press n over d 3500 over open parentheses 1 plus n over d again 7.2 second open parentheses going down scrolling down 12 go to the right otherwise it's going to say syntax error so we have to go to the right and close the parentheses and we are going to go this is exponent so we must hit this cap and 12 times 6 remember if you don't hit this cap is going to you know written in the same line which is going to be a completely different answer so we're going to hit enter and we do have a nice number so we have a principle approximately after six e i mean initially that is 22.75 dollar and 17 cents let's work it okay. out on the other side so well we're going to actually look for a a is given as what a is given as 3500 dollar 3500 dollar which is the total amount principle we have no idea we're figuring out one plus r which is 7.2 percent over n is 12 which is monthly to the power 12 times the year is 6 all right so we have that now somehow we have to actually come up with that what is there actually so let's take a look here we can actually work it out down here so we have to actually get through this so i can use the calculator actually i'm going to use a different way here in this case so i'm going to go inside this in, in case you don't have this calculator so we're going to go 7.2 divided by 100 enter divided by again 12 enter then add with 1 plus 1 remember this is the fam that's order of operation you first go with the division again division then addition finish the work in the parentheses then go with the exponent whatever answer plus one we enter actually then we go exponent 12 times 6 we can put down 72 or 12 times 6 doesn't matter 72 is going to be safer 72 enter 1.5334 times p and this is 3500 remember is going to be approximate there, there are some decimal number is going to be left over actually so well if we can have this down here so what we are going to do next we are going to actually divide 
1.53834 in both side 1.53834 in both side cancel out we have a approximate fee so we're going to use our calculator 3500 using the division sign 1.53834 Three, four. Remember, the more digit you have, the more accurate is going to be. So it's going to be approximate. So look, it's basically coming up the same thing here. Well, it's one cent here and there. Remember, there is approximation here. So it's almost similar stuff here. So if you work it out, the more digit you have, the more accuracy is going to get actually. So I would say approximately is twenty two hundred seventy five dollars and. In this case is 18 cents if we do this one again that would be the best